Hello everybody and welcome to Grand Summoners. Today has been a long time since I made a video. And the reason why I'm making this video is because one of my favorite animes is being, well, me coming to Grand Summoners. Now, mind you, this was predictable, but also unpredictable. I was hoping for this collab to come out sooner than later. <clears throat> But, nevertheless, I'm happy because, first of all, um, I got, what was it, I got reincarnated as a slime, the anime. It's a very good anime, it's funny, it's, it's well known right now. I've read the manga as well, but I am excited for this. I am excited to see this game, this go on global, and I'm so happy to see the crossover coming. Now, mind you, we will be getting the crossover on the 14th of this month. So do look forward to it. I am definitely look forward to it. <clears throat> and so, all you should look forward to it too. Because most of the free equipment is very good, very handy. And it is awesome because another thing is that it's very much for free-to-play players. <clears throat> Why do I say that? It's because of how easy the boss is to defeat. I have defeated this boss even with uh, all level 70 team. So don't be afraid. Don't be scared. The content isn't tough. It isn't difficult. Um, mind you, I do not suggest using like beginner, <laughs> beginner type um, teams where your units are not level 70. Because you will get, you know, owned. Now, the difficulty I, I would give this would be in intermediate or pro. Really between those two. It's not difficult. It's not hard. It's not a bat, like a tough boss battle. It's just easy and simple. Now, let's get down to equipments. Equipments wise, we've got the mask. We've got um two swords. We got a necklace, we've got um, two outfits, well, three outfits. One, the one over here, as you can see, I'm going to try to see if I can, oh, okay, never mind. The one all the way on to the left, which belongs to the girl, <clears throat> is uh, team-based equipment. It is not better than um, the Goku uniform, sadly. So, it will just be, might be a filler item if you guys do not have Goku uniform. But it is second to best to the Goku uniform because of how much um, art gen regenerates. Though I do not know if we were going to get the full version or if we're going to get a deep, uh, what's it called? A debuffed version. Now, mind you, the weapons are pretty interesting, which is also the necklace and the two swords. Mind you, those weapons are very interesting. And the outfit right here in the right hand corner, the one, the blue outfit. <clears throat> Ren Maru's uh, out shirt. It is also a weapon, I believe. If I do remember correctly, it does damage. Let's see um, if they will actually put up any information about it. Okay, no, no, it did not. So I guess I'm going to be running off this on information I have previously experienced. Um, Is his name Benny? Okay, I was right. Benny Maru. Benny Maru and... Um... Oh, it's Rin Maru. Oh... Uh... Rim, uh, that's a double R. I cannot pronounce that. <laughs> I, rim, oh, it's actually Rim Maru. Muru, oh, freaking Milium. Okay, sorry about that. Apparently, I made a mistake thinking that they did a double type typo here. They put Rim Maru versus a uh, double Mr. Double R over here in the top left hand corner, as you can see. Uh, but anyways, back to the, the information. The mask is very interesting, and it's very good. Now, if you guys hate using the, what's it called? The lesser demon heart. This is 100% a good substitute versus the demon heart. It does not beat, and no, it does not beat um the Christmas event items, which you get, which is also 5-star, um... I forgot what it's called. Uh, Fen's doll, I guess you could. I guess that would be its name. Fen. It does not beat Fen's doll. 
in coverage of our gauge versus on single targets. Though it does something like it. So I am looking forward to getting that mask since it is a free item. Yes, the three in the bottom here are all free items. So please try your hardest to get that mask. Like I said, this event isn't that difficult. It's not hard. It's very much free to play friendly. And that's what makes me happy about it is that it's free to play friendly. We do get um, Tensuru or Rim, sorry, Rimuru slime form for free. As you can see here, free luck unit. He gets two defensive equipment and one healing equipment. Two five star defensive and one four star uh, healing. So I just want to throw that specific out there. Um, the necklace, as you can see, is a five star attack attack equipment. Most of you can look up this information online. I forgot the website. Though, if you guys really want to, you can go to also go to the chat C three channel, go look on there, see if you can get that information. I have been sending out the information to my friends via screenshots. <clears throat> That they have posted on their main their Discord. So my friends already know what these weapons do. Mind you, um, Rinmaru's uh, sword, which is over here on the top left. Right, sorry about that. That was an email. Um, as you can see here, right next under, right on top of Ultimate, that sword actually is ghost. It's a very good weapon for demons, but it has a long cooldown time. So. I don't really like long cooldown time weapons, especially if I have a physical weapon that can overbeat that weapon. Mind you, during the raid, we have a weapon that boosts all stats by 500, so I do not really care for any physical weapons at this moment. But beyond that, I would actually like to just point that out, that this weapon does increase demon damage by 30% upon use. So it's a very good weapon as long as you time it right. Uh, Rimuru's uh, <clears throat> equips or his uh, outfit boosts all water damage, so boosts water damage, or should I say water damage? Uh, damage. Ah, does not boost attack. It boosts damage for water type units to their weaker element. There you go. All right. Um, the sword, which is, uh, Ben Maru's actual sword, his own katana. I forgot what it does. I believe it focuses around damage as well. It's just like the, the swimming equipment sword, but it does it on a weaker basis. <clears throat> I will have to look that up again. Mind you, his outfit, Ben Maru's outfit, is very good. Well, sorry, sorry. I'm thinking about the outfit over here, the other one, um, Mirror Millions outfit. Um, I found it interesting how what this outfit does. It's a defensive type equipment. It is also five star. It's actually surprisingly it does something with critical. I think your critical resistance. I, f if I remember correctly, it's it's the first equipment we'll ever see with critical resistance in my book. Um, oh yes, I forgot. Um, Ren Maru's outfit is a four-star equipment, which is magic. Uh, Ben Maru's sword is, um, five-star, as well as the water sword, which is for Dean. Ren Maru's sword is five-star physical. Mind you, the mask and Million's outfit are both five-star supports. So that just to let you guys know all that information, just to put it out there so you guys can be prepared for what's to be expected. Now, mind you, like I said, the mask increases. Oh, I did not tell you what the what the mask does. It does uh, 15 arc gauge for five seconds. <clears throat> mind you, this does beat um, Lesser Demon Heart by the fact that it also has a shorter cooldown time than Lesser Demon Heart. If I Let me see. Sorry, I just logged in. Jeez, uh, nice timing to perfectly log in on. And yes, my phone is dying. Don't worry, I'll charge it later. Uh, we're gonna can we hurry this up. I should just press cancel. Yay, Melecon, don't really core. 
Okay, where was I again? All right, let's go to the, see a check a lesser demon heart. Let's see equipment list, filters. Actually, descending. Yes, yeah, that. Uh, well, actually, it's supposed to be ascending, and then put rarity. Let's just put rarity. Um. Apparently, my phone is sensitive at the moment. It seems. Okay, here we go. Lesser demon heart increases. Argued by five for twenty seconds. Mind you, this one does okay. <clears throat> so it increases arts by fifteen for five seconds. Mind you, versus a uh, lesser demon heart, which does um five per twenty seconds, which is a hundred versus a uh, five times fifteen. That's seventy five. But the short the thing is that. Um, mass also has a shorter cooldown time, which is 35 seconds versus 40 seconds. Though, it's just like, meh. Because you get faster arc gauge re within the time of the casting. Versus the time casted it takes for, um, Mr. Demon Heart to kick in. So you can already get your arts up there real fast. And yes, the mass, just like, um, Lesser Demon Heart does stack. So I do look forward to that one as well. I just did my 30, 360 day login just now, today. But beyond that guys, I'm so glad that they're coming to Global. I'm happy. And we're finally getting them. Oh yes, and uh, the necklace, I did fail to mention, it does, um, it does burn damage as well. So it's a very good equipment to have when you're going up against the plant monster. I don't forget his name. I always forget his name, honestly. I really don't care for it. I just really hate the plant monster. Now that we have Ifrit, he would be making that so much easier. I will do a video on Ifrit and Palamecia's true, just like on here, like I did on the Japan. <clears throat> But beyond that, I'm going to go right down to what I was saying. The necklace is very good for um, fighting against the plant monster since it constantly has 80% chance to burn the enemy. Mind you, the cooldown time is actually very low. So once you max limit break it, it has a very quick cooldown rate, making it a lot more powerful and a lot more handy for hitting that burn. Making it 10 times as much easier to kill your enemies with the burn team. Such being like Mira, who was uh, all focused around, you know, damage towards burn enemies. And a lot of other units that actually do do more damage when the enemy is burning. Mind you, there are also units that you shouldn't be working on and have no point to evolving in the future. I'm just joking. Most all units are good units in my view. No matter how you look at it, no matter what you say, I will always say there are always good units. There are no bad units. Why? Because I said it before and I'll say it again. I used a very weak team, a very sucky team, and defeated that boss on uh, Rager Shrimp's challenge. And that team was very weak. It was constantly being summoned units. I forgot the team, what they who they were and everything. But they were easy to obtain units that you might have like constantly get copies of. But beyond that, so we have Renmaru, Milium, and Benmaru. They already tell you what they do and Slime uh, Renmaru. Mind you, boost uh, defense come paralyzed with arts. Well, that's pretty interesting. Boost damage with true arts. Hmm, interesting. I look forward to seeing the full details upon what each one of them do. Mind you, um, like I said, you can go to C3's Disco uh, Discord. Oh, I was like, Discord, like an idiot. <laughs> you can go to C3's Discord. You can go to their sections and see what these guys bring to the table. They have everything in translation um, for English. So, do look forward to this event. And I hope you guys have fun and continue to enjoy the game. Thanks for watching and 
Enjoy your day.